Hi and welcome to this video demonstration on implementing SVM. I am Raghavendra, an expert in AI, ML and data engineering. In this video, we shall be predicting the disease in plants given various features. We shall be using SVM to solve this classification problem. We are going to measure the performance of the classification problem by checking the accuracy and the confusion matrix. First, we are going to import the libraries, pandas library to read the data set. So here is the code to import the pandas library. Then we read the data set, which is in an Excel. So I use pd.read underscore Excel to read the data set. Preview the data using the head method. We can see the values for the columns mean standard deviation, entropy, skewedness and so on. And the last column of the data set which is the disease is the target column. Let's now check the info of the data using data.info. You can observe all the columns are of numeric type and all the columns have non-null values. Checking the categories in the target column using value counts. Here is the code to do that. We can see that there are four categories with values 1, 2, 3 and 4 and each of these categories have exactly 30 observations from our data. This means that there are four kinds of disease in plants. Each number refers to a particular kind of disease and this is a multi-class classification problem where we have more than two classes in the target column for prediction. So this is pretty much a balanced class classification problem with each class having the same number of samples. Let's next separate out the features and target into separate arrays. In X, we are going to keep all the columns excluding the target, which is the disease column. In Y, we are only going to have the disease column. Next, we shall be importing the library for splitting the data into train test. From sklearn.model selection, we are going to import the train test split. We are going to get four arrays, X train, X test, Y train and Y test. And to this method of train test split, we are going to pass x, y, test size of 0 0.25 and random state of 0. Next, we are going to import the support vector classifier from scikit-learn.svm, instantiate the support vector classifier. So here, I am going to make use of polynomial kernel while I am instantiating the classifier. Then. I'm going to train the model by passing X train and Y train to the fit method. Next, we are going to make predictions on the test set using the trained instance SVM underscore fit. We are going to pass the X test into the predict method and we are going to save the output in YPRED. Next, let's check the accuracy and the confusion matrix. For that, let's import the methods from scikit-learn.metrics. So both of these methods, confusion matrix and accuracy score is part of scikit-learn.metrics. Here is the accuracy score. For that, we are going to pass y test and y pred. We are going to get a value of 0 0.566. And here is the confusion matrix for this method as well. We pass y test and y pred. If you can observe, confusion matrix now is going to be a 4 by 4 matrix because the target column has 4 categories. In this video, we have learned how to apply SVM to predict the disease in plants, measure the performance using accuracy and confusion matrix. Thank you for watching this video.